Hey everyone, welcome back to Beard Nerd Reviews. And if this is your first time checking out my channel, hit that subscribe button. And after you're done watching this video, give it a thumbs up or leave a comment. And check out some of my other videos. I got lots of intake that I've done before and I got a lot more coming in the future. Okay, the company I'm reviewing today is going to be Chesapeake Beard Company. Gary is really nice to send me some of the products here for free with no problem. He also sent me a sticker. I did pay for the oil and everything else he sent out for me for just being nice. And thank you so much, Gary. Really appreciate that. So I got this bomb. And also, you can also get this on the site. You just have to pay for shipping. I do believe that's how it is. I don't think why he would change that anytime soon. He's been doing that for a while. I don't see why he would be changing that anytime soon. But you can try out a sample of oil and some balm from him. Okay. I am first going to review the Floyd, the, the sample. And then I'm going to review the... Felt this. All right. The Floyd has a scent. Um, it has it's a scent with a note of amber, rum, and a slight hint of musk. A classic scent with a powder, fresh smell. It's always shaker bottles, and this is exactly what it describes right here. Is this is a nice smell? I mean, I don't even think you even smell this anymore walking into a barber shop. I mean, I don't even remember the last time walking into a barber shop and it still smelled like this. They smell clean, they don't smell like this no more. And this is this. This is a nice smell. This is like a this is a memory from back in the day. It really is, and I just really enjoyed this. And also, the scent lasts all day. I have not haven't had an issue to. Reapply this to freshen up. I did have a couple of times I had to reapply it more than once. That's not I have nothing wrong with that. You do have to wait until it starts dripping a little bit. It's more one of those gravity ones. See, it's a little bit more. It's a little thin, but that's not that. It's not bad. But it did really condition my skin really well and. Really, the the oil really absorbed really well into my beard and onto my skin. I didn't really have too much excess oil. Um, that probably could happen if you put too much oils, but I didn't really have that issue. Now the bomb. It's got a slight yellowish tintness to it. Comes out really nice. This bomb is really soft. I mean, really soft, but it still has, I say it has a nice medium hold. Well, a little bit slightly under, but definitely in the medium hold stage. If you got a really big beard, this may probably be really good for you. It wouldn't be super stiff. I like the hold, it was a really nice hold. Nothing against this hold one bit. Oh yeah, this smells really good. You this it just it almost smells like when you're walking into the barber shop and they have that they pull that powder and they put it on your neck and everything and it go it is it goes in the air, you know what I'm talking about. It smells just like that. It's a nice, nice smell. It's a classic smell, it really is really good. And I'm really enjoying this. Now we're gonna get into belt fest. I believe I'm saying that right. This is a two ounce container. And the ingredients were the same as both of them online. I just, I didn't have the ingredients. So I just figured I'd just read them off the bottle. But Belfast has the same exact ingredients that Floyd does. And the greens are Jehovah oil, sweet almond oil, grapeseed oil, hemp seed oil, um, coconut oil, excuse me, essential oils, a, a blend, sorry. Really could not read that for a minute. Whatever. Okay. And uh, the scent that he has carrying this is a 
roasted oatmeal with a hint of spices. And to me, this smells like straight up oatmeal cookies. Like straight up, I think it smells like oatmeal cookies. Or so you're walking into a bakery and it's got all those the yeast and everything cooking and the spices. That's what it smells like to me. It smells like straight up walking into a where I would sell cookies. I always like sugar cookies almost. I'm debating if it smells like more like sugar cookies or oatmeal cookies, but this really does smell really good. This has a yellowish tinge. The other one also had a yellowish tinge to it too. I did not say that. I apologize. Also, is a thinner oil. Anyway, this just smells so really good. It really does. I enjoy the smell. A lot. Um, the sm scent lasted all day. Um, I did feel like I needed to condition my, um, add it a, a little bit more. Just like the other one. Just to condition my skin a little bit. Because it is a thinner oil. And it's not a bad thing. But the smell did last all day. So if you want a scent that lasts all day, this is definitely it. Bring into Belfast Balm. This is a two ounce container. And it's a spin off. Oh, we're going to ingredients. The greens are the same on both bombs. Um, the greens are going to be beeswax, coconut butter, shea butter, Jehovah oil, grapeseed oil, Sweet almond oil, hemp seed oil, coconut oil, and essential oils for fragrance. Okay. It is a, it's got a yellowish tinge to it. This is a soft balm, just like the other one. And it comes out really nice and easy. It melts really fast. Had no issues. No clumps, it just melt really, it melt really well. Into the beard, I would say this is maybe a little bit lighter than a medium, but it's still up to the medium stage, slightly under. Um, it did though condition my skin really well, underneath my skin really well, and I didn't have to reapply this more than once a day. I put it in my beard in the morning, and the balm held really well all day, but I did have to add re had to condition. Re -condition both oils though so but it does happen when you have thinner oils I have that issue um, you may not have that issue but really great scent Re did not irritate my skin one bit I would highly suggest to end this this anyway I give this company 10 stars I damn I'm freaking brain fart well, anyway highly just I'm checking these guys out I hope you do Chesapeake is an awesome company. 10 stars. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed making it. I, oh, also, I am doing a giveaway. So as soon as I hit 50 subscribers, guys, I'm going to be doing a giveaway video. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and you will have a wonderful day. Stay bearded, stay sharp, and don't forget to stay nerdy.